it's my sugar? I'm a fucking Viking, so I just vowed. Plain HTML. None of that JSX bullshit. Yeah, you have to give away ifs, maps, and early returns, but you get the original HTML attribute names, and that's just... Mm, plain HTML. Nothing better than starting a prototype with plain HTML. Just a div and a hell world. Then you put in some more divs, maybe a button, and sprinkle with a pinch of tailwind, cause we are prototyping. And if you need to be old school, a style tag at the bottom with whatever CSS your soul desires. Then we get to the action. Put in a script tag. Yeah, we're getting progressive, baby. And you wouldn't believe it. We is let. But that's forbidden. No, no, no. We have magic. Nothing is forbidden. First, put this var somewhere where I can see it. Now, a sign. A sign like your life depends on it. But how will it know? Magic. See, Svelte is compiled. And that's why it's pretty fast and the compiler will find every little assignment operator you've put in your component and it will make the component react. Jealous of how reactive Sveltis react? For control flow, you'll have to learn a bunch of awkward notation, but you'll get through it. Oh, and when reacting to state changes, put a dollar like that. Yeah, it's still JavaScript. I mean it is and it isn't. You know how JavaScript has all this obscure stuff, like technically there is a double equals, it's just not great. Guess what, there are many, many more things that nobody uses. The compiler will write it into normal code, just not the kind of code you would want to write by hand. Yeah. Now comes the big question. How is all this magic good? I could bore you with uh, hooks and a JSX and immutable patterns and have you really tried using Emma with an Emma with an Emma? But I love Svelte with all its quirks and flaws. And there's a lot more good stuff I haven't even mentioned yet. You don't click? Here you are. On click. On something else? Sure. Want your own on? Why not? Need to include a plain JS library? Easy. Need to check window size? Even easier. Animations? Done. Now let's say you need to store something globally. The so-called Redux problem. You know when you need Redux, but you don't want to kill yourself in the process of using Redux? Yeah, there's Zustand and Jotai, I know. There are stores in Svelte. They're built in. Yeah. Built in. And so nicely integrated. Yeah, Svelte has it all. And I haven't even mentioned the kit yet. Anyways, you do you. Svelte is still pretty new. It's probably not so easy to get a job with it yet. The ecosystem is small. But if you enjoy experimenting like I do, God, it is so good.